What's going on everybody? It's Skylar here. I hope you guys had a wonderful holiday. Yesterday was actually Christmas, so I hope you guys had a wonderful Christmas. I'll have a happy new year coming up. But I wanted to put this into the beginning of this video to let you guys know that this vlog is two months old. This is from my LA and Phoenix trip that I took from October 13th through the 25th of October. A good 12 day trip. This was just kind of me by myself trying to experience LA by myself because I might want to move there one day. So I think I say that throughout the vlogs that you guys will be seeing in the upcoming months. So I wanted to put this in the beginning to let you guys know that this is, you know, old footage, but it's uh, it was a long trip. So I have a lot of vlog content for you guys to be putting out. It was an amazing trip. I went to uh, a couple Drake concerts. I went to a Lakers game. I uh, you know, went to Santa Monica, did everything that I possibly could as I was there by myself. So I'm sure you guys have subscribed to me because of my music video content. And so if you're here from that, I want to thank you guys for subscribing. We have a lot of good music videos coming in 2019. There's probably four or five planned already that you guys will see between January and, you know, April, like, you know, four or five within those, you know, four months. So it's going to be crazy and you guys are going to absolutely love them. But for now, I'm uploading vlogs. That's what I do on this channel. This, this channel is just for everything that I do myself. So thank you guys for just enjoying my content, whatever I do and support me through this journey. So I'm gonna stop talking and rambling on. I want you guys to enjoy this first vlog from LA. It's probably gonna be around five or six maybe by the time this trip is over. So thank you guys for watching. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. So that's gonna be it for me guys. And uh, yeah, peace out. Make sure I got everything. There's my two cats. Oh, my sweatshirt. Got everything. Two cats are probably gonna follow me. Right there. at the airport. Alright, so good news guys, I'm in the elevator, they had early check-in for my hotel, so it's pretty much lit. Um, I got a goodie bag because I'm a rewards member, so it's pretty much crazy out here. Alright. Jeez, dude. Jeez, dude. What's my room number? I don't know. 508.
end of the hallway. Okay. I get the corner room. The corner room with double windows, bro. Oh my goodness. I did not expect this. I thought I was getting some basic room, dude. Hotel Indigo, man. And they hooked your boy up for being a rewards member. As if I did anything to be one. Shout out to my dad. This is nuts, dude. Oh my word, it's freaking cold. <laughs> Drake concert tonight, baby. All right, guys, back on the vlog camera and not my phone. Gonna head out. It is currently like 12.15. I'm gonna go eat some lunch. I think downstairs in the hotel, honestly. I don't know if I wanna get any like restaurant food right now. Gotta, gotta eat some somewhat healthy food before the concert tonight, you know, so I don't give myself a stomach ache or something. But yeah, after I eat food, I'm gonna be heading to Staples Center, checking it out and seeing what I can find about lining up before the concert for general admission. And so yeah, that didn't make any sense because I said and so yeah. Anyways, doesn't matter. About to go eat, catch you guys when I get my food. This hotel is honestly super sick and I wish I was staying here more than one night. Unfortunately, I'm only staying here for one night, like I just said. I don't know why I said that, but yeah, I wish I was here for the whole time. to Staples Center right now, like I said, guys. I know you guys saw my breakfast. It was on fire. We are headed to Staples now, see what time I should be starting to line up for general admission at the Drake concert. And, um, yeah, maybe take some pics too, so let's get it. Good, you know, I've just talked to some of the workers outside and they said probably get here at three or four. It is currently like one in the afternoon. Yeah, that's where people should line up for general admission. And so that's what I'll be doing in two or three hours. Change into my outfit and um, yeah. So I don't know if you guys saw in that footage, but they have this weird like TNT tip off advertising event thing going on over there. I don't know why, because it's a week away, but I mean, they can do whatever they want, but <clears throat> well, maybe like a couple days, not a week away, but getting kind of warm out now, as you can see, the sun is out, so that's pretty much it, um, not sure what else to do, oh, wrong way, yeah, not sure what else to do, might try to get a pic of myself, but I forgot my backpack, so it's going to be hard to set up a prop to try to focus the camera, it's just going to be annoying, but yeah, <sighs> let's get to it. Hopefully you guys can see me. Let me adjust this real quick. All right, there we go. Whew. Okay, so it is currently 3 p.m. ish. I'm not sure. I haven't checked my phone in a minute because it's been charging. But um, before I head out to the concert, I just want to tell you guys how I'm feeling right now. Honestly, it's like absolutely insane just to be like where I'm sitting at, all by myself, literally in downtown Los Angeles, like. 
in this amazing hotel and I just honestly can't believe it. I'm just so blessed and grateful guys. Um, it's just honestly insane. Um, I'm glad I saved up for all of this to be able to pay for this trip. Um, besides this hotel, that's the only thing that I didn't pay for. I paid for everything else, airfare, Airbnb, everything. Lakers ticket, concert ticket. So all paid by me guys. Don't think I'm just like pretending to show off like my parents' money when pretending it's mine or something. Like no, like I did this all myself guys. Like I said, besides this hotel for one night. And I'm honestly just so blessed and grateful to be able to do anything like this. It's insane just to look out and there's LA and it's just, I don't know. As of late, I've been thinking, thinking more and more every day just how grateful I am just to be where I am today. And I think everybody should do that no matter what situation you're in because we're alive and uh, it's pretty amazing. But I'm about to head to the Staples Center and stand in line for three hours till we get inside the building. Maybe make a friend or two. I might have to. I'm not really sure what to do with merch. I don't know if, when to get merch because I need to get my spot in the front. So I don't know guys, I'm just freaking out right now. So I should head out so I can get a spot. I'm gonna have a charger, I'm gonna have water, granola bars. So I'll be able to eat those before I get into the stadium just in case I need to. Which I probably will just because it'll last me the rest of the night probably. Cause I won't be getting food at the concert. There's just no time for that. So yeah guys, this will be the last clip you'll see on this camera until I get back to my hotel probably later tonight. So yeah guys. Got my snacks, portable charger, phone, wallet. We Gucci guys. Let's head to Staples. Alright. If somebody lets us. Oh, we gotta go all the way around, dude. All the way around. Oh frick. Alright, I gotta make a vlog segment for my for my video I'm making on my trip. It's about 6.40 right now. Just waiting. We have this light in front of us that's blinding us, so we have to sit down as you can see. Can't see anything, so it's just great.
Yeah, it's too late for that. Make some motherfucking noise for yourself.
tried to stop with Los Angeles. I can't ask for much more. Make some noise for yourself. And I look around, I see 18,000 people from all races, from all places, and we having us a good motherfucking time tonight, listening to music and enjoying each other's company. So I want you to remember this, when they try and tell you every day how the world is supposed to work, or how fucked up shit is getting. It doesn't even matter if it comes from the President of the United States. You remember this night in Staples Center, because you got it figured out. I'ma tell you, I can't wait to finish this tour. And it's not because I'm tired. I can't wait to finish this tour because once I've done this tour, I might not even go on vacation. I feel like going straight back to the studio so we can be straight back in Staples Center having another party. I love y'all with all my heart. You're an incredible crowd. You are more than any, 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 any performer could ever ask for. And I will love Los Angeles till they take me off this earth. And thank you for letting me get a house here and live here and share this beautiful place with y'all. I go by the name of Drake. I hope you get home safe. All right, what's good, y'all? Chilling outside LA Live Staples Center area, talking to myself, all by myself here. Which is kind of unfortunate and kind of sad, low key. I got nobody to hang out with. All these people hanging out with friends, enjoying their time. I'm just chilling here all alone. But anyways, just got out of the Drake show. That was the, honestly the most litest thing I've ever done in my entire life, guys. Drake brought out Travis Scott and LeBron for sicko mode. I knew LeBron was there, I saw him in VIP, but I didn't think he'd be coming out like that. And Travis, I had an idea too because of his uh, Insta story, but other than that, guys, oh my word, I'm shook. I'm so shook, guys. I can't talk, I mean, I can, but. Um, what was I saying? So yeah. I decided not to buy merch when I first got there because it was going to stress me out and I didn't want to like lose a spot in general mission, but it didn't matter. I I wasn't going to lose a spot if I went and bought merch anyways, but at the end of the concert, I was like, ah, I should just buy some merch. So I bought $175 worth. I don't, I don't even know if I'm going to like it or if it even fits. It's the worst part. So I think I'm going to go to another show in the form earlier or later next week. So maybe if I can get some more merch there or something I don't know and my nose is runny and there's a bunch of people walking by and I don't really care but yeah guys that was absolutely the nuttiest thing I've ever done in my entire life that concert oh my word one thing I didn't like about our spot is Drake didn't really come over to that side a whole lot it was like we were kind of almost like the back of the stage I didn't really understand it he didn't like come over there that often but like when we did, it was like we were all lit for him. Like we were just as lit as any other part of the crowd, but I don't know. So when I go to the forum next week, I'm not gonna go on that left hey! side. Anyways, yeah, I don't know what else to do. I need a Kleenex, I need water, and I want a smoothie, guys. I really want a smoothie right now for my throat. It would feel so good. But yeah, guys, that's it on me it's kind of trash being alone not gonna lie all right i will catch you guys back when i get to my hotel so i'm out of here guys see you in one second <laughs>